And so instead of like doing anything, I decided to order food. So I ordered a Coke. Oh, they, thanks, thanks person for knocking that over. Um, I got <clears throat> two miso soups apparently. I think I thought I only ordered one. Um, salmon sushi and mame and then teriyaki chicken. So I'm gonna go eat that and then see you guys later. really freaking late to this Riley Rose grand opening event. I have to go to the VIP starts at 6. It is right now 5.32 and I'm an hour and two minutes away. So I really love that. I was got distracted and so I'm wearing kind of the same thing I wore last night. My pink IMG pants, my white shirt, and my pink um, bomber jacket. Let me grab it. My pink bomber jacket from BSBW. It's like see-through but I'm going to wear it over a white shirt instead of like I did at the party wearing like nothing under it, so let's go. I have to hurry up and go, so we're just gonna run and basically try to make it. You know, it's a lot of fun being super late to something and then just like sitting in traffic. It's literally bumper to bumper, like literally parking lot traffic in the heart of downtown and I'm just like, I'm so late to this and it's like so frustrating. I'm literally gonna get there at 6.39 .30, and I need to be there at six and it's six in one minute, so. That's cute. Also, this lighting sucks. Oh, people are honking now. It's literally a parking lot. Yay! This is fun. Guys, I've been at the Riley Rose event. I dressed in all pink to match the store. And it's super cute wearing my IMG and this thing I already told you about. Emily just made it here. She was late. So was I. Don't worry, though. They know. They know. We got a rose, a box, and a bag of goodies. And we're just walking around the store. It's so pretty. Like, look at this fur thing like it's aesthetically pleasing for like instagram stories and i'm just gonna vlog for you guys and try to take photos and stuff i feel like we're like, gonna remove all the toxins and debris and so i've been taking pictures doing things i have more stuff i talked to um lime time they were really nice I found out we have a hundred dollar gift card to buy stuff I don't know what I want and I'm literally walking around and I'm just like I don't know what to buy So I'm gonna look around and try to find stuff to get and I'll show you guys at the end of this vlog So we're headed out of Riley Rose. It's like very exciting We're headed out. We're gonna have to go Bye. We're going to Target. We're going down to Target And then we are headed over to shoot with Matt and it's gonna be extremely exciting because we're doing this fun little thing. Shout out to Riley Rose, thank you for having me. I love you guys. So everyone, me and Emily are at Yamashiro. We got spring rolls, we ate all of them. It's right there, and then edamame, and then there's Emily. She got her hair done today. She might have a story time on her channel like months from now when her channel exists about that horrible, tragic experience. For the first time ever, we're sitting outside in the garden. They added these weird tarp things, which they were never here before. And I'm very excited. It's like really pretty actually. I kind of like this better than looking at the city. Because this is more like private and more secluded. I really like it out here. So we're going to continue to eat. Bye. So guys, I'm home from the Riley Rose event. And I'm going to like tell you guys what all I got. I got quite a few things. It's actually a day after the event, which I'm hoping is fine. But I got sick and I'm still a little sick. So I'm just going to unbox things and then end off the vlog here. This vlog is literally just going to be this event. I don't know. So I'm just gonna unbox these things and probably end off the vlog here. I'm not really sure. It might just be this event, but we'll figure it out. I'm gonna start with the bag that I got from them when I walked in the door. So it comes with this like pink tissue paper that says Riley Rose all over it. And then I got this box from a box company. I do not know. And it, oh, but this is actually really cute. <gasps> oh, so this box has a mirror in it and this like trays that like swirl out so it's like a mini makeup kit i guess like it's perfect for like travel or something not really sure what i'd use it for because i use a mini cali 25 or 28 depending on what i need for when i go places so i wouldn't use that however i might give that away in a giveaway and i got this snow white and the seven dwarves like zip thing from the snow white 1937 collection it's a snow white book and it's literally just like a makeup pouch or something. Also, once again, probably not gonna keep this. However, 
I might. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll keep it just for the collection of having it. Then from Lap Coast Ketchu, I got a hand cream. I don't use hand creams, but, you know, that's fun. Then from Bosha, I got a Luminizing Black Mask in black. I have this exact same mask in pink, and it came with this little kit of, like, a pin and, like, this note and, like, a pouch. Once again, I don't need that pouch, but okay. Then I met the owner of Lime Crime. This actually didn't come in the bag, but the owner of Lime Crime gave it to me. And she was like, I love you. You're really sweet. Here is a palette. And I checked out the palette while I was on the stand, and I actually freaking love it. Like, Beam and Heavenly are so freaking pigmented. It's, like, crazy. Like, I actually love this. So I'm definitely keeping this, like, duh. I'm a little bit more mellow in this, like, unboxing because I'm sick. Oh, I also got that rose that's right there. But you guys already know that. Then I got from Bonilla, I got a mascara, which I picked this out. And I picked it out because of the packaging. Literally, the only reason why I wanted it was because of the packaging. Like, it's, look at how it's so sleek. And, like, I just, I love Then I also picked this out. They're Vegan Silk Lashes Spectrum X Mean Girls. These are in Regina George collectibles. I need that. I got an activated charcoal toothpaste, which I hear are amazing. And I actually wanted to pick one of these up, so I'm glad that I got this because I'm probably definitely going to use it. Like, duh. I needed it. Then I got an egg cream mask. It's a single-use sheet mask with egg and coconut water. Yikes. Then I got Winky Lux Under Eye Concealer in Shade Deep. I'm not Shade Deep, but I'll give that away in a giveaway. I love Pinky Rose. I'm one of their top peoples or whatever. I got to pick out two. I picked out Cancer and Siren, which is the blue glitter wand and the red glitter wand. The red glitter wand is one I really, really wanted that I saw at the Fame Expo, and so I'm glad I was able to finally get it. Then I got House of Lashes Clear White Eyelash Adhesive Glue because last time I used Tarte Lash Glue, I glued my eyelids shut. That was not fun. And I got this Winky Lux like, lipstick, I think, in Skinny Dip, which I like the packaging for Winky Lux. It's super cute. Oh my god, of, yes. I love this. I love the fact that, like, I'm a packaging whore. Like, if packaging is cute, like, I literally will love your brand. I will buy anything just because of the packaging. From Lime Crime, I also got Wet Cherry, the Ultra Shiny Lip Gloss in Naked Cherry. And it is literally the exact same component as, like, a lot of other companies. But it's cute. Like, I love it. And I actually really like the wand. Like, it's fat and, like, applicable, you know? Just, it's kind of like the, um... The applicator for, what's the brand? Fenty Beauty. I really love her bomb gloss or floss gloss or whatever. I don't even know what it's called, honestly. I do not know, but I love her gloss because of the applicator. Also from Lime Crime, I got the Unicorn Hair and Valentine, and I hear that it actually really, really works. It's like a red hair dye, so if you guys see me with red hair, this is how I got it. Then from Winky Lux, I also got this little, like, gold pouch filled with goodies. So let's open it up and see what's inside. A lot, apparently. So I got a transforming pH balm. Oh my gosh. Okay, packaging. Look at these little pills. It's like a pill. What? What? Watermelon jelly transforming pH balm. It is clear. Do you guys see this? It's clear. That is so freaking cool. I love that. Okay, I may actually use this. What is a pH bomb? Transforming pH bomb. Mine is in watermelon, which is perfect because I love watermelon. Watermelon flavored or scented anything is like the best. What else did I get? Then I got a feliner, which is a waterproof eyeliner. That's a cute name. The packaging is really just not that great. It's just like a regular like tie liner or something. Literally, 
And then the So Extra Mascara. Let's see how the packaging is. This is cute. It's like got winky eyes and it's like circular. Still not my favorite. I think my favorite from Winky Lux is probably that. The, um, the pill bottle. You know, love that. And then I got, oh my god! The original Mr. Melon Chewy Watermelon Candy. Guys, they knew. They knew that I loved candy and watermelon. And an eyeball pin. And then a lot of confetti. So that's all I got in this bag. I also got this cute little bag that says Riley Rose. And, and then they gave me a gift card included as well. And so I bought a few things using the gift card. I got this Clean It Zero cleanser because I was told that I needed it by a sales associate. You know, I literally am one of those people where like if a sales associate tells me something, I'm gonna get it. So it comes with like this weird thing. Cause my face breaks out when I wear makeup so I hear that this like helps with that. Then, of course, I got the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder, the Better Not Bitter Flower Setting Powder by Beauty Bakery because uh, Jeffree Star talks about this all the time and hi, anything Jeffree Star loves and it's Jeffree Star approved, I need in my collection. Had to pick that up. And then finally I got two things, the Static Reusable Nails in Pink, in Nude Peach, and in crushed diamonds they're like nails i'm living for them i'm super excited it's for a perfect manicure in seconds that can be removed and reapplied and finally in this bag i literally just have the gift card which by the way is super cute like look at that little taped on rose hello super cute So that's it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, follow me down below. It's Christian Aaron and Christian T. Aaron for everything else that's not Instagram. Christian Aaron's Instagram and then Christian Aaron 2 is also my second Instagram, so go check that out. Drop a like, subscribe, leave your post notifications on because you can get notified every time I upload a new video. And I like the vlog styles more, so I'm probably going to do more vlogs and sit down videos because I like them more. They're more fun and they're more fun to edit and watch and stuff. So I'm probably going to be doing that more, but I love you icons so much. Bye.